Hello ladies, Laura Gabriel here, and I've got your day eight of the Morning Miracles Challenge. You're gonna hear from Kathleen Smith, her lovely voice, urging you on to reading your Bible each and every morning. So stay tuned. Good morning, ladies. We are day eight into the Morning Miracles Challenge. We read about the armor of God in Ephesians 6, 10 through 18, with the breastplate of righteousness mentioned in verse 13. We also know that the breastplate protected several vital organs, with the heart being the most important one, of course. In the Roman days, the breastplate protected the soldier in battle. For us today, when we go to battle, Satan will attempt to attack our most vulnerable organ, which is our heart. So we put on spiritually the breastplate of righteousness for protection. God's righteousness, right standing with God, comes to us through Jesus' death and resurrection on the cross. The way we get to the right standing with God is to spend time with him daily. When we continually put on the breastplate of righteousness, we secure it with the belt of truth to keep the breastplate in place. Once we are saved, God gives us the Holy Spirit to steer us in the way of righteousness, to walk away from sin. Several ways we use the breastplate of righteousness. Turning to God when we face temptation, James 4, 7. Guarding our hearts against the devil's schemes, Proverbs 4, 23. Avoiding what may ensnare us. In Matthew 5.30. And then some extra scriptures on righteousness is Matthew 5.6, Matthew 6.33, John 3.16, and Romans 3.10. Today is the letter R in pavers. R is for reading. Today's question is, do you feel or believe that righteousness is a one-time, one-and-done deal? Have a great day, ladies. See you tomorrow. Thanks for listening, and we look forward to seeing you for day nine of the Morning Miracles Challenge. This is Laura Gabriel, signing off.